welcome here to this next chapter and uh, we are now going back and hopefully well it is daytime again and I think we are going back to the into the town yes yes that's what we do now when we have all three of them I think I will try and see if there's something inside the library some informations in there which I can use A tall statue of a man stands prominently at the end. You do not want to go back in there. You never know when Hagatha might return to continue her search. The library was not designed to be scaled by impetuous adventurers. And uh, let's now ask her if there is another good book. Yes? Could you recommend another good book? No. I'm sorry? No. You have read every last one of our good books. The only other title you may find vaguely interesting is this one. The librarian points to the book sitting on her desk. It is entitled, The Annual Book of General Knowledge. All right, so let's see if this book can... This book is entitled, The Annual Book of General Knowledge. Browsing through it, you notice an interesting excerpt. Did you knew, did you know eating certain types of fish has remarkable transformative effects? Eating white snake uh, allows communication with the nat control an animal world cookies make good camouflage the rumor about unicorns and who can see them is not true mixing animal hair in lotions and potions can cause intriguing side effects goats are natural enemies of trolls wands are like pets life is like a box of chocolates some worlds were created perfectly by the gods, while others were left to be recreated. Fairy dust loses its effectiveness with age. A white his man reached the lines in the sand for direction. All you need is love. Interesting. Maybe we can use that. And that rounds up this chapter. You have entered the town of Kalima. Two buildings. The town gives you a... We'll see you next time in another chapter.